How the heck did they pull that off? Not just another Murphy bed model, because there's a ton of those out there, but a 60 by 80 True Queen Murphy bed, and one that's not some weird kind of folding mattress bendy bed. Just a one-piece mattress that flips up and down, locks into place so you don't accidentally lawn chair yourself and get locked in the front end of that thing, bent up like all kinds of weird RV twist em up yoga or anything like that. And they managed to accomplish it by giving this RV a small front miniature drop frame, almost like a fifth wheel, so that that extra long mattress has some place to basically nosedive into the chassis of the RV because the ceiling is six and a half foot tall, although it does have a vault, which really helps, especially when you're standing in the shower. And you may have noticed in the bathroom, you've got the bigger vent fan, you've got that water saver system. These are enclosed in the belly with standard tank heaters. They're running on Goodyear tires with tire pressure monitoring. Factory standard solar, inverter, double Asdell, and a partridge in a pear tree. And I hope that helps because the first time I saw this, I thought to myself, 